Hi YouTube, my name is Herdy AU and welcome back to episode 6 of my Let's Play series of SOMA. Uh, in our last episode, uh, we were on our way to um, the Lambda station. Uh, we came across a shuttle train system, which of course once we activated and took off, it crashed halfway uh, to our destination, which resulted in us in having a little bit of a swim uh, to find the station. Now we of course did that and came through this door here from the outside world and we are now in the Lambda station. So we are now heading in and see what happens. Now I have noticed my screen is a little bit uh, fuzzy. I wonder if that's because I need to heal up, but I don't know why. Because I don't recall being hit by anything or attacked. Or maybe it's just a gradual thing, I don't know. But let's have a little bit of a look-see around. Uh, nothing out there. It's in here. Mm, okay. Alright, so we are looking for... Oh, shit! What the fuck was that? Okay. That what was that? All right. Well, let's cautiously head down. Catherine. Be quiet. Don't look at it. Don't look at what? Don't look at it. Oh. Oh! Don't look at it. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. Oh! What the hell was that? Oh, diesel! What? What? All right. Um. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. How do I get past it without looking at it? Oh, fuck! Oh. Really? Okay. Where are you? Do I, uh, do I have to keep going down this way? Oh, this is creepy. Don't feel safe. Where are you? Um, I'll come back to that. I'll probably need to do that, but where is this Catherine? Where are you calling from? Uh, right, of course. No, not you too. I was really hoping you were human. Don't let the circuitry fool you. I was human once. Can't take it anymore. This is... Everything's fucked. I give up. There's nothing left. Calm down. It's not the end of the world. You sure? It sure as hell looks like it. For all I know, there's no one left except for me. What do you mean? I'm right here. Don't take this the wrong way. But I meant any humans left except for me. Have you looked at yourself lately? You're a walking, talking diving suit with some electronics left on for good measure. I... I don't... You don't want to think about it? We'll start thinking about it. I... I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to be this. I want out. Before you do anything hasty, could you help me with something? What? I was trying to find out what happened with my project when that brute knocked me to the ground. Your project? How could anything possibly matter when you know you're a stupid robot in a stupid dead world? Okay. Focus. I need you to fix me so I can get back to work. Then you can sulk as much as you want. You gotta be kidding, right? I think I have a better chance of building myself a time machine than of putting you back together. I just need to access the computer. Oh, is that an Omnitool you're carrying? Oh, the door opener? I picked it up at Upsilon where I woke up. 
That'll have to do. Plug it into the terminal. Sure, whatever. When the Omni hmm. tool is loaded, just plug my Cortex chip into the tool. What's a Cortex chip? It will be obvious. I'll eject it for you. Just grab the chip and slide it into the Omni tool. Come on, I just need you to do this one thing for me. Sure, whatever. Lambda terminal 27 activated. The Omni tool is ready now. Should be easy enough. Just pick up the chip and slide it into the Omni tool. Why does a robot chip fit a door opener? It's standardized connect. Uh, Catherine? All right. Let's give this a try. All right. Guess we're taking Catherine with me. Custom Cortex chip found. Shutting down helper chain. Have a nice day. Just pretty much anything will fit. Oh, this feels weird. I'm in the Omnitool? Thanks. So, what's the project about? My project? Oh, well, I saved all the people on the station as brain scans and put them into an artificial world. We were going to launch it into space to save it from, uh, well, all of this. Are you telling me that you were going to launch a computer world filled with people into space? Yes. It was just a pet project at first, but it got really serious after the comet took out the surface. Then suddenly it became very important, and it was officially named the Ark. That's appropriate. How far did you get? I don't know. That version of me that I am. It came from a scan I did pretty early on. The living Catherine could very well have finished the project and launched it. I guess she could even still be alive. Huh. Weird thought. So the talking robots, are they also scans you did? They could be, but I doubt it. I'd expect much more sense if that was the case. Ah, all right, finally. What's happening? I managed to restore some data from the backup server. This should tell us everything we need. Oh. Could you do me a favor and run into the other room and have a look? I don't seem to be able to view the files in this condition. I need to know that the Ark is safe. Sure, Kath. Thanks. I'll unlock the door for you. What was it you said before? Are you from Toronto? Yeah, I just went in for a brain scan and suddenly here I am. That doesn't make any sense. How? Why would anyone bring a scan from Toronto? You think that's strange? What if I tell you it was back in 2015? Whoa. Check the computer in the other room. Okay, things are starting to make a little bit more sense. Back in 2015, I did see some documents, I think, in an earlier episode where obviously the dates are a uh, little bit in the future by the sounds of it. Talks of comets hitting the surface and launching things or people into space on this arc. Right, so. You say something? Sorry, still trying to figure out how you got here. Keep at it. I'd really like to know who thought sending a Canadian to the bottom of the sea was a good idea. Yeah, so obviously this is in the future, I guess. And everybody's emotions, consciousness are stuck in robots. Oh. What are you doing? Be careful. Fuck, I don't know what I'm doing. Fuck, I'm out of here. Now, where's the other room with the computer? Still got to figure out how to get away from those. That creature was strangely overbearing. Yeah, it basically exploded with electromagnetism. That's bad for us, right? Confusing, at least. Gives the senses a good punch. Yeah, that thing. So, as I was saying, I was wondering how we uh, get away from it if we can't look at it. Now, where's this other computer? No, this door's opened. Um, which one, which one, which one? What's this? Just a map. Something's beeping. Just check the computer. Yes, look for anything about the Ark. Okay. Um, 
Is this from Let's inside the Ark? Yes. That's some early renders of the world inside. Looks a whole lot comfier than this place. Mm, yeah, so... Yeah, orbital... Mm, trajectories, I guess. Um, satellites. So obviously, yeah, this arc must be something that got civilization or the human race off of Earth before the comet hit. Welcome. If you are reading this, you have successfully entered the arc. This... Okay, we've entered the arc. Hmm. This survey is designed to give you the developers a better understanding of your subjective experience and how to improve your well-being. Please continue with the survey. How would you describe your physical condition? Oh, hmm. Choices, choices. Don't think normal is really the way to go right now. The way things are starting to unravel. I'm going to go four. How would you describe your mental condition? Oh, righto. Uh, lost seems to be the way to go as well. Hmm. Maybe not. Disconnected or altered? Hmm. Let's go altered. How would you describe your senses? Uh, more sensitive and aware of my surroundings. Blocked as if my senses are numb. Okay. I'm lacking one or more of my natural senses. Let's go blocked. Things are a little weird right now. How would you describe the sensation of your new condition? Oh, something's wrong. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go something's wrong. Are you troubled by the fact that you're no longer strictly human? That's odd. Um, mm, let's go two. How do you perceive your new existence? Um, hmm. Let's have a look. I don't know. Uh, let's go four. Do you think this new existence will be a life worth living? Hmm. Yeah, I don't like what's going on. Would you rather be removed from the project and accept death? Oh. Let me think about that one. Okay, your answers have been saved. Thank you for participating. The ARC team. Oh, okay. ARC tracker. I found a tracker homed in on the ARC. Oh, that's clever. I wonder if I thought of that. Does it still work? I really need to know what happened to it. I think so. It's doing something at least. Where is it? Hold on. I'm trying to find it. Please let it be safe. Is it heading towards the sun? the spot. Oh. Okay. Uh, is it still on Earth? Oh, I think we're getting closer. So is the Ark still on Earth? Are we going to have to go find it and launch it? Let's head this way. Let's 
So I don't think we're going to be able to fit an arc into a station. I mean, I'm assuming the arc is a big it. vessel. It's at a site named Tau. Oh, no, it's on Earth. It's so close to Phi, they almost made it. Damn it, it won't make it for long in that state. A couple of decades at most. That's not much to build a future. If we got to it, could, could we get on the arc? I suppose, but I'm not exactly flexible at the moment. I'm not going to bother with the other two. I can move, jump, swim, sort of. You're stuck in the door opener, the Omni tool. I'll just carry you there and you'll show me what to do. That sounds really risky. Besides, I don't like the idea of you carrying me around. Come on, Catherine. This is what you wanted to do. Your final mission. Let's launch the Ark. We would need to find a way to get into the Abyss. Can't take the climber without a power suit. We probably have to go to Theta and pray the Dunbat's still working. Okay. So we go to Theta. I don't know, it's pretty far. Catherine, look around. What else is there to do? Maybe there's still a working shuttle train that can take us to Theta. I doubt it. Just have a look around. Push comes to shove, I'll walk there. Okay then, I'll just eject from this thing. Don't forget to take me with you. I won't forget. Yeah, I won't worry about the other two. Uh, I guess just because they're probably, like you say, or like they were saying, just the opinion of where getting on go? this arc. I'm waiting. Can I pull the Omni tool out? Wait, wait, wait. Okay, just be sure to plug me in again at some point. You got it. Good luck, Simon. Ooh, you can't talk to me through it. Okay. Yeah, I'm kind of just. I'll, I'll plug you back in. I mean, you're the only one I got to talk to at the moment. Still got to figure out how to actually survive against that walking explodey thingy. Shuttle station. No power, of course. Oop. Goo. Okay. Tight corridors. Always what you want. What the fuck was that? Uh, please don't be on this side. Damn it, I just did a circle. Oh, come on. Alright. Okay. No idea. So we've got to get to Theta. We get to Theta. Uh, let's touch it. Jesus Christ! What the hell? Sticking it right in there now. Okay. That was different. Is it because I'm wearing the suit now? Oh, swim time again. Let's see if we can go find Theta.
What's that down there? Just have a quick check of this, see if there's anything in there. Takes us to uh, Theta. Sorry, or not, that didn't sound good. Ah, of course. The CV came from Curie. It was a ship that used to make runs between Lambda and Lisbon. Looks like their wreck is close. Maybe you can find a vessel like this one inside. Sounds like a plan. I'll just save the security information and update the Omni tool. There. Should help you get around. Okay, so I'm going to try and find another one of those. That's a... I thought it was a bigger looking fish, but I think that's just another robot. The last one was pretty slow when it chased me, so hopefully they're all the same. I'm just going to try and run past it. Don't think it saw me. Hope it didn't see me. Yeah. Uh, follow the lights. Let's see what happens. Oh shit! What the hell was that? What was that? What was that? What's going on? Where is it? What is it? Hide! Hide! No idea what was that. What's going on? What was that? Why did the place shake? Okay. Weird. I think that's just a precursor because something's coming for me, I guess. Or it's lurking around and I'm going to run into it. Ooh. This looks like a wreck that... Catherine was talking about. This looks wrecky like. Hopefully, there's nobody in here. Not really much space to move around. Even less space to walk around in case something jumps out at us. And the screen's going funny. Yes. Something's close. Hmm. Cracks in the roof. I hope it can't get in from that way. Okay, this may not be the wreck that we were looking for. Oh, I can't get back in. Great. Oh, what's going on? What's going on? Now what? Now what? Just run. Oh! Oh my god! What was that? How... Is it following me? Don't look. Okay. Okay. Alright, we've had our scare. We've had our scare for this episode. I'm going to leave it there. And uh, we will continue on this journey on the way to Theta, trying to find the wreck that we actually need and uh, get in whatever emergency vessel we can to take us the rest of the way. If you did like this video, uh, give it a thumbs up. That would be great. And in our next video, we'll continue our journey through the water uh, to Theta. 
Thanks for watching.